hi guys welcome back to my channel today i have an easy and simple diy basically what you'll be needing are about five mm, I, I would say four to five of these bracelets from dollar tree you'll be needing some scissors a needle and some thread all i'm doing here is just ripping the label out of the bracelets and then i'll be grabbing my needle along with a thread So here all I'm going to be showing you is how to connect the uh, thread to the needle and I'll be showing you with this brown thread but I'll be using the white thread just because it's more, it's less visible. All I did was grab my thread, insert it into the needle, I extended a long piece of the thread. Once I have the thread connected on the tips, you're going to go ahead and tie a knot on both of the tips. Once you have that, then you're ready to go ahead and insert your jewelry in. Here I'm just showing you how I'm ripping apart the bracelets and just scatter the little pieces around just because you do want to have everything separated. And I do have a centerpiece and the centerpiece is this butterfly. I do believe I purchased it at King Dollar. Once you have your centerpiece, you're going to go ahead and start adding your jewels Once you have one side done, you're gonna go ahead and do the other side just for it to be just exactly the same. Here I'm just showing you another one that I did. Um, and I did have like a whole bunch of little pieces, different ones um, throughout the year of collecting them because uh, they are actually bracelets that I purchased. I'm just gonna go ahead and just use them with the ones from Dollar Tree and create like a nicer, like a much nicer one. Here's a short clip of showing you how it came out. I did create it a different one, like a uh, with some tones of pink, black, and just clear ones. And as you see, the circle clear one is from Dollar Tree, so you can go ahead and purchase those as well and recreate like a whole different uh, necklace and I did call it necklace because it's basically like a necklace but I'll be adding it to my rear view mirror from the car and trust me when I say that you're gonna love the DIY on the rear view mirror of the car because when the sun hits it it's just sparkling all over the place so that was basically it guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and i hope to see you guys on my next one bye